Hi. So today we are going to have a live on uh, what to consider before we start, uh, you know, a project in rural or uh, you know, under-resourced communities uh, for menstrual hygiene. So we're going to have Sanjina and Rajasi today. Here, so we have them. I'll just add them to the video. Yes. Um, Sanjina is unable to join. Sanjina, uh, I'm inviting you again. Sanjina, it says you will need um, a latest version of Instagram. Uh, can you update your app, maybe? Rajasi, I have accepted your request. Yes, Rajasi is here. Um, hi. Hi. Good to see you. Uh, Sanjeev yeah, is just yeah. taking some technical glitch, so I think she should be here soon. Uh, she may just update her app and should be able to join. Uh, yes, so today we are going to speak about uh, what happens or what to think before we go ahead with projects. Uh, a lot of... Uh, even during lockdown and even otherwise, um, we know a lot of CSR projects, a lot of uh, donation projects that keep happening in the menstrual hygiene space, uh, which are uh, usually uh, more dominated uh, by one activity, which is distribution of sanitary napkins. Uh, right. But today we will sort of delve deeper into that. Um, so we'll just yes, wait for Sanjina. Yeah, yeah tell me. Sorry. Yes, and not just about uh, you know what what happens exactly there, but also like what points to consider when we planning something like this and how to go about it. Okay. So right, we will right. discuss all that and. Um, yeah. One second. Sandina's request is here. Yay! Hi! Hi. Finally. Hi. <laughs> Can you hear me? Yes. 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 Awesome. Wonderful. So before we go ahead, I'm going to give a brief, very brief introduction about both of these people and then we will request them to talk a little more about them. Okay, so first of all, um, Rajasi. Uh, Rajasi is um, crazy and dream menstruator as her uh, Instagram handle <laughs> says. Uh, but actually she is one such crazy and dream menstruator uh, for all of, all of um, you know, things that people would really call crazy. Um, some may call it under the garb of green, but uh, I'm sure that it's not under the garb of green. She's one such real green soul. Um, I've learned so much from her. I feel so... I, I think that's one thing I'll always be thankful that I've, I got a chance to meet you and know you. Uh, and then we have that's Sanjina. That's a sweet introduction. <laughs> And then we have Sanjina, whom again I met because of Rajasi, and I'm glad I did that. Uh, I've been a fellow of Rangin Kirke Foundation, and that's how I met Rajasi, uh, sorry, Sanjina. And I think great because she does some amazing work in the gender and sexuality space, which usually is a taboo, and I'm glad she's doing that. So, Thank yes. You. Thank you so much. Glad to be a part of this. Uh, everybody who's watching, uh, this is a part of Rangin Kirki and our beautiful fellows, uh, brainchild 
a social media campaign which is called Amplify Whispers. And me and Rajasi have been extremely fortunate to have found such amazing fellows who are yes, so creative, yes. so uh, dedicated, so responsive, and uh, you know, so such badass people also. So <laughs> I'm glad that was. Also, <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. Thank you so much. So maybe uh, I'll start with Rajasi from um, one bit in the sense uh, one one introduction for you is usually a uh, menstrual health educator. But mm-hmm. of what I've known is your journey started in Chhattisgarh and um, yeah. that has uh, a, a very crucial role in your journey and also has a role in today's life so maybe if you can speak a bit about that uh surely so um so in 2013 i moved to chatisgarh for a small just one year fellowship and um, i moved there because my boyfriend was there <laughs> so <laughs> that was my reason to move to chatisgarh there and uh, it was i thought that it's a very nice opportunity to uh, spend time in the state he lives and also um, um uh, since i have never worked in rural area so i thought like why not why not take this opportunity for learning so that's how i moved to chatisgarh and uh, till date i am i think i'm still in chatisgarh though my physically i live in mumbai uh, for 4 years but i'm still there and um, i will say i'm not the same person if i look at myself a decade ago and uh, it's not the same thing because uh, i learned so much what exactly this you know green green menstruation yeah you know being a green person what exactly that means uh, i think what we all do as a urban people is um, you know we are just doing like really tiny bits but actually the green people are the people who are the tribals who are uh, who spend 24/7 with nature and it was such amazing learning opportunity and now i connect virtually with these people because of covid but then uh, every time i go there there is something to learn like i feel ki are ye kabhi socha hi nahi tha and you know there is still so much to do like you always feel that and uh, i would say just i will just add a, a small part why i became this you know green menstruator so i was always a cloth user i will say uh, until i went to uh, my graduate college where i uh, had to be outside for a whole day so then i switched to disposable pads like fully earlier mm-hmm. before that our disposable was used only for emergencies but then when i went to chatisgarh i had already converted like you know using disposable fully and when i moved there i saw that there is absolutely no system to dispose the waste and uh, um, and you know we have been taught that this is the ultimate product and i was like ki tab khoj shuru hua ki then what is best in this context and then that is where i actually learned what exactly context means and how things are different when context changes so yeah so that's that has played a very major role in what i am today and i never thought i will be menstrual health educator because um um i went to chatisgarh i lived there for 3 and 1/2 years with the thought that i will be uh early childhood educator <laughs> but i am something <laughs> else right now <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. I'm glad you are doing this. But uh, on that note, you said that you realized that in Chhattisgarh, no, I can't say that no system is there, right? To dispose uh, sanitary napkins. Technically speaking, in the rural area, I would say rural, correct. especially. Technically speaking, no system is anywhere. I mean, maybe just like yeah. picking trash from one place and dumping yeah, in yes, another. Yes. So no one can not be really called a system. Uh, कुछ बोला रंगीन खिड़की फाउंडेशन इंटरेस्टिंग नेम क्या है सो आई थॉट सो आई डिट टेल हर बेट अबाउट इट एंड लाइक वाउ कुछ तो है ये नाम बिकॉज दैट टेल्स यू अलॉट 
uh, and, and i really like that whole you know peeking out of a window which is colorful uh, you know so that right. gives such a hopeful thing yeah yes so yes. so uh rangin khirki means uh, for everybody who understands hindi they know what it means but people who don't understand hindi it means a uh, color colored or colorful window whatever you want to call it why because i feel window is like a metaphor it's always like a perspective and colors also represent perspectives opportunities so we wanted to create a window of colored fit a bit diverse perspectives and diverse opportunities hence rangin khirki happened uh rangin khirki started last year in february 2020 we primarily work in the space of sexual and reproductive health and rights menstruation is our core area of work other than that there's also uh, con- uh, you know conversations about abortion rights uh gender sexuality education all of that um why it happened because i've been working in this sector for i think close to 7 years now uh not in the srh sector but the social development sector i've worked with organizations uh implementing bodies funding bodies uh csr bodies all of these i've worked in the health programs education programs all of that i've worked with 20 year old organizations i've worked with startups and all of that and but then uh gender and looking at the regular stuff using the gender lens have always been something very close to me and being a menstruator i've had my own journey i won't call it a struggle or a challenge but a journey so uh, when i made uh, when i started uh, working as an independent consultant there were a lot of opportunities that came through and uh, i started looking more at the programs which were talking about menstruation or related to menstruation and i myself independently started a lot of work around menstruation which is when i realized that uh, and a lot of conversations that i started were around products and it's interesting that today we are going to talk about products because my journey yeah. with menstruation somewhere started with those products only but yeah when the conversation started with products i realized that you cannot see a menstruator or the menstruation the process of menstruation in isolation you have to look right. at the individual in conjunction with all of their stakeholders all of their uh, cultural context and all the other uh, you know allied stuff and i also eventually realized that why is menstruation a taboo so it's also because it's very closely linked with sexuality and reproductive health right and uh, in a patriarchal society uh, marginalized gender and their bodies are always always controlled is a site of a lot of political battle uh, linguistic battle and uh, oppression so which obviously uh, made me think a lot and then slowly i realized okay menstruation ke bare mein baat kare to contraception or pregnancy or abortion ke bare mein bhi baat karna padega agar aap in sab cheez ke bare mein baat karoge to logo ko to pata bhi nahi hai ki yaar body mein teen alag alag jagahein hote hain for teen alag alag purposes so those yeah. were the conversations that started coming up and we realized okay let's look at doing it doing a more constructive focused work and yeah rangin kitchens and ever since there's been no stopping us aka internet it is a little yeah yeah she's back yeah thank you sanjina um that's pretty exhaustive work that is done Thank yeah you. okay um audible am i visible uh, things seem frozen yes thoda sa freeze hua mm-hmm. beech mein ha ah, okay okay yeah, now i can so hear okay so uh, rajesh going back to your um, okay even before we go back to chatisgarh is there any sort of uh, you know i'm going to ask you both this same question that uh, what are your observations of 
uh, you know people working in the sector or you know what are the kind of projects that you normally find or you know the aspects or what are their um, goals when they say that they, they are working in the menstrual hygiene sector so what do you think are usually the goals of people in, in this space okay uh sanjina you want to take it or you know shall i start and you add yeah i think let's do that you start and i'll add okay so uh i will say it's been a mixture of you know experiences uh when i see people working like or i been working with people so i will say there are kind of three kinds of you know organizations or people i will say there are one who are very product centric like they will um, you know just give away one product um, maybe it will involve some awareness session and it's just one or two contact session that's it so that is one one way of doing it then there are some organizations who will you know for few months they may take feedback or they may stay in touch with the people with whom they did awareness sessions or with whom they did something and there are i would say there is this third type of people who um who will kind of handle the community for longer duration like for more than 3 or 6 months i will say like you know for a year or two years so that they see uh, if exactly behavioral change that they wanted to happen if they if it happened and um, and it's not i will not say that when when the pro- projects go on for long they are not project centric uh, they are not product centric anymore so they are more of behavioral change when it comes to pra- healthy practices and uh, different things so there are some organizations who are you know very dedicated and then um, as sanjina also said then it covers the umbrella of the you know reproductive health not all will do it exactly or maybe they they, they may not start it with that purpose exactly but then when you have longer programs it does happen like the you take care of the umbrella and not just product or just uh, some part of menstrual health so yeah. so i think these are different kinds of people that i have come across in this space uh i have also uh, along with the types that rajesh mentioned i have also come across people who uh have kept menstruation as one of the components in in larger programs uh i've been part of those programs i've been responsible in rolling out those programs also so i'm yeah so that's another truth uh but i have also seen so now also when i go to a lot of communities there are programs that are to a large extent product centric uh but yeah hopefully when if the project duration gets longer and if it's not just one workshop or one event oriented program that then very as uh, you know rightly pointed out by uh, rajeshi it does not really remain a conversation just about products yeah right 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 um so so is so essentially a lot of products possibly start with sorry a lot of projects uh, start with uh, products and then if they continue longer they would they may uh, cover a lot of other aspects as well right so there are two aspects to it and coming from spaces of community organizing i'll tell you why a lot of organizations have a product perspective is because to also uh, initiate a change in the community so mm-hmm. often what happens if you're talking about certain product uh, and you want them to really really use it or change it or whatever uh if you're giving certain things right away uh the level or the chances of acceptance are more mm-hmm. and often that becomes an indicator for many projects uh an indicator of success so that is one perspective that we have yeah. and uh it also is useful for mobilizing the community so i been of programs which i'll tell you which when started these were big funded programs people have been given mobile phones and people have been given a huge amount of medic medicines and everything so this this model 
so there's a mix of these two models so there's a model where uh, because no, you know it's very hard to get into a community and push them to continue to interact with you over time to wo nahi aayenge wo tumko samay kyu denge you know everybody's time is money so they are not going to come so the only way is uh, you offer them something in exchange and i i've been told that by many many organizations many many communities that kuch nahi to aapko khana peena to dena hi padega nobody is going to come here and sit and stare at your face and listen to you talk about stuff that is important for them but they don't think it is important that's where your hmm. um maybe need analysis is helpful like what aap kya karne ja rahe ho ya aapki community ko zarurat bhi hai ki nahi लीविंग एंड कमिंग सो यू नो एक I mean, this is the reality of the sector. There has Correct. to be a barter system. Correct. True, true. true. Which is tangible. Only then, you at least first have some sessions. You can do. After that, Correct. there is again a relationship that you know gets created. So, ye hota ek. Uh, I won't say that. Is no such a wrong thing. Everybody has different ways of organizing the community, uh, but. There is also a very strong need to understand that आप जिस काम के लिए जा रहे हो या आप जिस काम उनके साथ कर रहे हो जो काम जो support आप दे रहे हो उसकी जरूरत भी है या नहीं and of course looking right. at the cultural context. Yeah, uh, absolutely. So, absolutely. So you know, uh, from what you said, Sandeep, uh, one thing is that because we, you know, mostly these are city dwellers. Of course, I'm not trying to generalize, but in a lot of cases. city dwellers are going to economically poor sections or rural sections and trying to change something about their lifestyles now as it is humans are usually you know hesitant towards change so yes they may not have enough of motivation to come and attend and you know give their time basically um also the fact that uh, what you said was uh, one important aspect is uh what is the change that we are trying to make and why is it and how are we trying to make it right so if we are trying to uh make people understand about uh, you know details about the process of menstruation um and different aspects of it uh mm-hmm. then uh is that important okay uh, you know in a lot of cases um people in the rural area would know a lot about themselves or they might have different way of connecting they may not know possibly you know typical terms or say a vulva or a vagina or a clitoris they may not know that but they would still understand their body and they connect with it in a different way uh so how much is it that we need to go and teach them or change them you know what what is that kind of a need um, is what i would like to understand okay so uh, there are two ways at looking again so one thing is there may be need at times especially for uh, matlab i understand what you are saying ki mm. कुछ लोगों को ऑलरेडी पता होता है इन अ डिफरेंट वे लाइक दे मे नॉट नो दो एक्सैक्ट टेक्निकल वर्ड्स बट दे मे नो यू नो व्हाट इज दिस फॉर एंड व्हाट इज इट अबाउट व्हाट आई एम मच केयर्ड ऑफ व्हेन इट विद कम्स टू एनी कम्युनिटी आई फील मतलब मुझे तो लगता है कि हर किसी को मेंस्ट्रुअल हेल्थ नॉलेज की जरूरत है इरिस्पेक्टिव ऑफ व्हाट दे आइडेंटिफाई वेयर दे लिव इफ दे लिव इन यू नो पवाई मुंबई और इफ दे लिव यू नो इन सम is in assam we all need that so i will say until i used cup myself i was not aware that i had three holes at the age of 23 i had realized this i mean like kya hai ye <laughs> and i have been menstruating since i was 10 so itne saal lage mujhe ye samajhne mein so and uh, my parents are doctors yet i am not aware so shame on me is, is what i felt 
so <laughs> so this is what the truth is that is the truth and uh, we all need that education so wo ek bahut zaruri hai that is what i want to point out ki uh, i will not say ki unko kuch bhi pata nahi rural areas mein yeah. ya economically uh, challenged logo ko but i will say it will just help them fill the gaps which they don't right. know that yeah. is one thing. uh yeah. one thing could be this revision for them and uh, sometimes hum bhool jate hain ki are ye aisa hai waisa hai and uh, so for me i would say um uh, ek kisi ek ka aise hi maine session attend kiya koi educator hai and i just attended the session for support supporting them and then they then i realized ki are ye points main bhi kisi zamane mein cover karti thi aur main recently cover nahi kar rahi hu and for me again it was a new learning opportunity yeah, right. so aise so you there's nothing i feel ki you know uski kami hai baat karne ke liye and yes. sometimes uh, and another perspective ye hai ki matlab fill the gaps ho sakta hai ya nayi jankari ye ho sakta hai and second uh, i feel is ki sometimes uh, pata hai wagera sab hai but uh, there's no space to talk um, never given yes. the opportunity to talk. Okay. so i feel that is very important wo opportunity milti hai na humko pata bhi nahi hai na to hum khojte hai तो आई वॉज प्लेजेंटली सरप्राइज लास्ट ईयर की कंसिस्टेंट सेशन किए छत्तीसगढ़ में तो देर वॉज दिस वन वुमन कहीं से रिपल इफेक्ट हुआ है सो दैट वुमन पता नहीं कहाँ कहाँ से लाइक दे स्टार्ट इट टॉकिंग वट मेन्स्ट्रेशन एंड शी आस्ट मी की मैम आपके पास कप है क्या मुझे देखना है मैंने अमेजोन पे देखा है एंड आई वॉज सरप्राइज की रायपुर लाइक द डिस्ट्रिक्ट सॉरी नॉट रायपुर दिस इज अ वेरी स्मॉल प्लेस इन बस्तर डिस्ट्रिक्ट वेरी स्मॉल प्लेस वहां पे आसपास कोई घर नहीं थे दैट वाज द ओनली स्कूल देयर एंड शी हैपन टू जस्ट हैव सम नाइस इंटरनेट और उसने ये देखा एंड शी आस्ट मी सो आई वाज लाइक कि बॉस ये गलत है कि रूरल में पता नहीं है वगैरह ये माइंडसेट wow. छोड़ दो काफी डिफिकल्टी difficult or you know they are hurdles they would not let you do things that you can do otherwise that in itself language as you said is so crucial so it's still been used in i will say my not exactly my immediate family but it's still there yeah my mom asked me today only ki uh, in bengali we call it shori kharab it means tabiyat kharab hai and well so oh acha are you unwell i said no i am just having my periods <laughs> so I think mom can't do that you know what your daughter does you know what the kind of conversation that i can't come to me and ask me this uh, now okay what do you call it call it periods that's it okay i'll try <laughs> that's so true absolutely yes so uh, now coming to the to the you know base the the important discussion which is about what do you think are the aspects that should be considered when uh, you know projects are taken up so who wants to go first um i think the cover your basics so your basics are know what your community is like know what their needs are know what their cultural practices are uh see i want to again go back to the product centric question that you had so as the pad industry boomed the sanitary disposable mm. pad industry boomed the entire conversation i am glad that 
uh, i mean i want to recognize and acknowledge that they have done their part in at least bringing menstruation to the forefront right in mm. the sense mm. there were ads that were being featured on prime time tv ठीक है भले ही व्हाइट पैंट दिखाते हो और यू नो इट हैज अ लॉट ऑफ यूफेमिज्म और भले ही विस्पर्स कहते हो हां ठीक है बट बट स्टिल एट लीस्ट यार मतलब कुछ भी नहीं बात होती थी वहां से वो वहां तक तो आया बात एट लीस्ट पीपल वर वाचिंग टीवी आई नो मी व्हेन आई स्टार्टेड वाचिंग दीस एडवर्ड्स आई वुड आस्क माय मॉम दैट व्हाट इज इट सो एट लीस्ट इट समवेयर जोल्टेड the entire society and created a space to at least have some conversation but what eventually ended up having uh, happening was the entire uh, conversation got limited to a certain product right and, right uh we and a lot of us are guilty including myself because i've been part of such programs in my early career where the vision was uh to to push the community in accepting more quote and quote hygiene hygiene product and therefore uh, the conversation was only about ai ya kapda use mat karo disposable use karo and then okay. they were also fed that how it is convenient they were fed how it is uh, more modern you know those kind of concepts were con- was continuously woven right. into the conversation so there right, right. uh uh and we, as i said we are all guilty of doing that without really knowing that hamari community actually karti kya hai to mm. abhi as ki dikkate aati hai that i often go back to the communities at least in calcutta where i worked earlier and it is it is a struggle because i know i have gone there if not me somebody else from my team have gone there and spoken about this say 6 years back and today i am there talking about something else all together so uh, also realize that yes as a project you might have funding and you might have that support where you can give away products but also ensure that you're giving it only when they need it or you're giving it because you've had a conversation with them where they are open to try this yeah or right. uh, yeah. you know there's some other pressing need not just because you think or your project team thinks right right might. right right oh So yeah. Yeah, this is very well put actually Sanjina. I just uh, I don't think uh, I would uh, have something different to add. I just want to add a very small thing over here. Um Sanjina pointed out that you know needs assessment is zaruri. Hum kab se yahi bol rahe hain. So needs assessment is something you need to put effort in doing. So I have seen organizations writing proposals. I was I have also done it some time ago. Ki proposal itne short notice pe banana hai. and uh, you actually don't get time to you know speak to some women so i remember i uh, i was offered one consultancy project in probably in 2018 or 19 so they were really nice people but then the csr who was funding them they were so much in hurry to release the fund and all uh, so what happened is they what they did is they they said we will do the needs assessment and actually was appointed as a menstrual health expert kind of person so the organization for whom the project was happening said ki um, you know rajesh you just share a, a, a questionnaire with us so i did share questionnaire with them and later these people i don't know when they went on field we had suggested ki you don't even know the language uh, we know the language like me and the other people from that organization uh, nothing was asked to us uh, i don't know when they went on the field and in a place of 1 lakh population they went came back with interview of just 20 people and they made their decision based on just those 20 people i mean how fair is it so this is what i would like to ask people and uh, you know you need to need assessment people do it in a day i personally think that you know it's not something that has to be done in one hour two interviews three interviews nightly you have to sit with people have conversations with them and then you understand what their needs are you simply cannot fill out a questionnaire and get you know get the need ho gaya now on the basis of this we are planning out a project that does not happen i mean it will happen i know it will happen i think you know that it or proposal 
लिखने के लिए आई एम टेलिंग मैंने भी प्रपोजल लिखे हैं आई स्टिल डू लिखने के लिए कुछ भी लिख सकते हैं डेटा कहीं से भी उठा के लिख सकते हैं मुझे पता है दैट इज नॉट सो डिफिकल्ट टू डू वॉट इज डिफिकल्ट टू डू इज अंडरस्टैंडिंग द एक्चुअल नीड्स ऑफ पीपल एंड एक्चुअली वर्किंग ऑन वट दे नीड एंड यू नो वट नीड्स टू बी डन देर एंड वट हेल्प दे नीड बिकॉज ऐसा नहीं होना चाहिए कि प्रोजेक्ट खत्म हो गया तीन महीने में या तीन साल में वॉट एवर एंड दो पीपल डोंट फील लाइक कमिंग बैक टू यू दैट इज दिल से दैट इज द डेथ ऑफ द प्रोजेक्ट दैट इज नॉट द सक्सेस If those people don't feel like connecting back to you, so I mean we need to look at all these different things, and the um, and there and there are many things that those are interwoven that may not come out of a Google form or just fifteen minutes talk. You have to sit with them, and uh, so for me the ideal way to do needs assessment will be meeting them at least two to three times, and. यू नो अंडरस्टैंडिंग कि एटलीस्ट दो बार तो भी मिलना है तो तो अच्छे से बात होगी पहली बार तो सिर्फ यू नो मुलाकात करने में एंड सो इन मराठी वी कॉल हवा हवा करने मुझे जस्ट बताना कि यू नो वी आर प्लानिंग टू डू समथिंग लाइक दिस एंड समथिंग लाइक दैट सो जस्ट बताना कि यू नो व्हाट व्हाट वी आर थिंकिंग अबाउट दिस एंड देन इन द सेकेंड यू नो वेन दे कम विद माइंड सेट एंड देन दे लिसन टू यू एंड देन दे शेयर देर ओन स्टोरीज so you build that rapport and based on that you if you make projects people will really like what you do and they will actually feel that that is for them yeah yeah so you know basically uh, something that we had been speaking um, in the previous post about creating safe spaces uh, you know safe enough for them to have conversations come back whenever they need something or uh, whenever they have a query um also come back and say ki boss wo product sahi nahi tha if at all you know the last time what you gave or uh, yeah me i i was not comfortable to use it so probably i sold it which is also something that happens right that a lot mm-hmm. of products which are given to them are then uh, sold because they are not comfortable to use it or or maybe because they need the money that's it oh, like yeah yeah yes yeah. like they, they need the yeah. money and you also have to look at the viability of your project right there's no point in sometimes there are needs uh, i want to just add to what rajasri was saying that there's something called needs where your community really needs it but you don't have the existing support system to actually uh, take that need forward you know Correct. so isliye when we did our video i think with puja there were so many conversations that we've had when we did the insta reel that what does safe menstruation actually mean mm, and that so cool. if i am designing a project which is only and only product centric or something you know just have one focal point without really taking into other factors into consideration wo project to kabhi matlab ha matlab project khatam ho jayega but community in fact correct correct guides are not a project so you have to look at that aspect also correct correct right uh, also um, you know when we are uh, saying this i, I remember uh, having this conversation with you sanjina that we really need to have a bottom up approach as compared to what you know a top down approach which currently really happens um also so one thing that i have also come across is um, you know so i also take sessions and when i take sessions in you know, a lot of cases what happened something recently that happened was um, you know a few cloth pads were donated to one particular ngo and uh, i was asked to take an awareness session uh, for for those women out there and um, um and they said that we won't pay you because we do not have funds to do that this just ha- added one you know this just made me thinking that what happens chalo ye wali ngo ko to alag scene tha ki inko pads bhi donation nahi mile the theek hai but however with a lot of organizations this happens that they would put money into buying pads or whatever the product is but uh, if they have to put money into someone who is a resource person they wouldn't want to do that they would feel that skill comes for free so yahi kar le uh, yes the, yeah. uh, two things actually pooja ek mein baat batau kya matlab it's not just always for free 
90 percent of the time they have not considered a uh, cost of resource person. I will say that. So, वो consider ही नहीं किया है उन्होंने कि वो भी करना पड़ेगा. उनको लगता है आधे घंटे में कार्यक्रम खत्म करो हो गया. So, uh, so this is very competition, है ना? Very important. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> And no idea uh, how many. uh disagreements and <laughs> challenges i have had in convincing people about not necessarily having photos sorry that's it go on <laughs> yeah yeah sure sure no it's very important and uh, one more thing that i wanted to add is ki jab maine abhi hum bol rahe the na ki uh there is not a lot of thought that goes into you know planning such things uh, so uh, not exactly calling out people but uh, you know that's a sad uh, so uh, especially on um, occasion so like uh, abhi maharashtra mein abhi gudi padwa jaise ugadi and different different states mein usko bihu aur kya kya bolte so that time uh, generally as a time pe na people take opportunity to do some event in um, communities and uh, very less thought goes in it and uh, i remember jab sankranti tha so i got a call at 11 o'clock ki 12 baje mujhe 200 sanitary uh, cloth pads chahiye and i was like dude i don't even have so many aur mujhe pata bhi nahi ki aur kiske paas kitne sare honge 200 ek time pe and so i asked them ki aapko kitne logo ko dene hai do you know how much one person needs so have you done such kind of thing to so, kuch nahi tha and uh, then i told them ki theek hai manage ho jayega matlab uh, then i made a couple of calls and then manageable ho gaya tha wo but then uh, ye jo last minute karna hai and then i actually heavily you know uh, insisted ki you know education has to happen if you are giving away new product because then uh, it's not uh, correct to give away some product without any education so fir baad mein like now they are like asking me proper proposal uh, but i know that it's not going anywhere because uske baad kuch reply nahi aaya mujhe yeah so uh, so as you said you know importantly resource person ko ginte hi nahi hai jabki matlab it's like the instruction manual that you find with every new product right it is not considered important but when when it is a new product and so you don't know the features and so you need that instruction manual the so sort people are like that but unfortunately mere, they are considered free mere ko bhi aise sawal puche gaye hain uh, i think education ke liye aap kyun like paisa kyun dete ho aap to mera point ye hai ki aap fir apne don't pay your teachers also right when you sending your children right If knowledge is, but uh, हाँ मुफ्त में बट रहा है शायद, which is great, but you are also paying your teacher because that person is giving considerable time in and has skills to you know take your child from one stage to another. तो फिर आप teacher पैसे देते हो, you know uh, I don't know, मेरे को समझ नहीं आता है, but क्या करें? Yeah, so basically I think. something which is very important is a a safe space that you should be creating when you're going for any any project yes, b yes. is educate about what exactly is your vision i mean at least have that vision clear in your head is your vision only to distribute pads or is is the vision to educate about menstruation as a process or, or maybe about a little about pms or maybe Uh, you know a little about safe days and safe days whatever could be anything but what is your uh, you know i vision behind doing that project um right. also next um, is that what product do you think is they have to consider uh, you know distributing a product what product uh, or what are the basis on which a product should be chosen I think Sanjina should answer this. Ah, I think yeah, जो चाहिए उनको वो choose करो और don't uh, I mean this is a conversation that has happened many a times on various uh, platforms and personal level also मेरे और आज से बीच में सब five thousand times already. So uh, 
मतलब एक तो है यार मतलब सस्टेनेबिलिटी क्या होती है तो दैट इज वन कंसर्न दैट आई थिंक राजू सी आल्सो शेयर्स एंड द कन्वर्सेशन दैट यू हैड विद अदर एक्सपर्ट्स आल्सो सस्टेनेबिलिटी शुड नॉट एंड कैन नॉट एवर बी अबाउट अ प्रोडक्ट सस्टेनेबिलिटी इज वेयर व्हाटएवर इंटरवेंशन यू आर मेकिंग दैट is infused into the existing ecosystem of that community right so wo becomes a part and parcel of their lives that is what your right, right. what all of our vision should be hum log yahan pe product thok ke nahi aane wale number 1 number 2 uh ye dhyan rakhna chahiye ki uh aapke project ka success does not lie or is not the owners of the person that you are working with right to so, agar main community ke sath kaam kar rahi hu ya specifically main aurto ke sath kaam kar rahi hu to uh, my success should not be indicative uh, should not be a result of them using a certain product mm, right right so it can my rather my what my success and what rangin khid ki success is uh, is a journey yeah. and that journey from knowing nothing or knowing something to knowing a lot if not hmm, all of it right. a lot of it so that's right. what so humko aur ye question mujhe kafi baar pucha gaya hai by probably potential funders also ki aap impact kya kar rahe ho because we have a mix of programs we have we do it with certain communities repeatedly we do workshop based interventions also तो आपका इम्पैक्ट क्या है तो मेरे लिए मेरा इम्पैक्ट ये है कि जब मैं बच्चे के साथ या किसी के साथ बात कर रही हूँ बिगिनिंग ऑफ द कॉन्वर्सेशन वेन यू आज द क्वेश्चन की पीरियड्स होती क्या है या महावारी में होता क्या है टिल द पॉइंट वेन दे आर सी स्क्रीमिंग आउट वर्ड्स लाइक वजाइना एंड वलवा एंड योनी एंड मुझे भी बहुत कुछ मतलब सुनना पड़ा है वन पॉइंट क्योंकि हम लोग एज एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन वी प्रिंसिपली एंड एथिकली सपोर्ट सस्टेनेबल प्रोडक्ट्स बट वी आल्सो रिकॉग्नाइज एंड रियलाइज दैट इन टाइम्स ऑफ क्राइसिस इन टाइम्स ऑफ यू नो डिफिकल्ट सिचुएशन जहाँ पे हमको पता नहीं चलती है कि कम्युनिटी किस स्टेज पे है क्या कर रही है वहाँ पे कोई प्रोडक्ट हम आना सही नहीं है और समटाइम्स इट कैन ऑल्सो बी अ स्टॉप गैप सोल्यूशन राइट एंड इट्स ओके if it's if, even if it's not your stop gap solutions are not supposed to be sustained so agar mm-hmm. aap us time ke liye kuch kar rahe ho ki hum log jaise kuch kaam last year kiye the around uh, during the lockdown during the uh, super am fun ke time pe ha uh, am fun which hit bengal to isme kafi conversations hue the because we were doing a lot of work in sundarbans which is already an endangered uh, you know location environmentally and uh, also a lot of women are from the rural under resourced rural spaces who were probably rightly using cloth also but again my intention or angin kiki's intention was not uh, to just give them products ki yaar ye sustain tum to kapda use karte the to isliye main tumko kapde ka pack de rahi hu it is not ar yaar ghar nahi hai chate ur gayi hai nahane ka jagah nahi hai टॉयलेट्स नहीं है पीने का पानी नहीं है मैं तुमको कपड़ा दूंगी तो भी क्या होगा सो यस आई आई टुक अ डिसीजन एट दैट पॉइंट बिकॉज आई डिट वॉन्ट टू पुट द ओनर्स एंड बर्डन ऑफ ब्रिंगिंग अ चेंज अगर वो यूज करना है right, तो right. अगर नहीं करना है तो किसी और को दे देंगी यू कैन डू एनीथिंग एल्स विद पैट्स यू यू हैव टू यूज इट और आई डोंट नो गिव इट टू समी और इफ यू आर वेरी एंटरप्रीनियर स्किल्स बहुत अच्छी है तो आप सेल कर दोगे उट शेमिंग 
मतलब ज्यादातर अगर आप एडवर्टीजमेंट्स भी देखो तो यूजली कपड़े के साथ गंदा ये ऑब्जेक्टिव ऐड कर दिया जाता है uh, काफी प्रोजेक्ट्स में अगर सेशंस भी लिए जाते हैं तो वो कुछ इसलिए लिए जाते हैं टू टेल यू दैट हाउ योर कपड़ा इज सो बैड बट वट आई वॉन्ट टू अंडरस्टैंड इज और मे बी से संजीना इन योर के शेमिंग कुड बी बाय पीपल हु आर वेरी प्रो सस्टेनेबिलिटी कुड बी कि भाई तुमने डिस्पोजेबल्स बांटने का फैसला कैसे लिया इट कुड बी अम ऑफ दिस ऑल्सो आई एम सेंग इधर वेस्ट बट दिस वॉज आइडिया और एस्पेक्ट अबाउट शेमिंग द यूजर्स आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट यूजर्स नॉट अबाउट द पीपल हु आर यू नो डोनेटिंग बट हाउ आई मीन यू नो वॉट रोल डू यू थिंक दिस प्लेस okay i'll take this so i think um, if you are if you are a person who is going into the community um, for a project or as an educator or any xyz entity theek hai aap ja rahe ho to or if you are you know this social media pe aap apna page chala rahe ho where you talk about menstruation uh, mujhe na ye sab ko bolna hai aap kuch bhi promote kar rahe ho you don't need to call something else bad to call your product nice matlab kapde ko ganda bol ke disposable acha hai ya fir abhi sustainable ke hisab se log kar rahe ki wo log disposable ko you know disposable aisa hai waisa hai hai uske cons pata hai humko fir isliye ye cup lo ya isliye ye cloth pad lo i have issue with this mindset कि आप सस्टेनेबिलिटी भी प्रमोट कर रहे हो उसमें से फिर भी मुझे प्रॉब्लम है उसमें से बिकॉज यू शुडेंट यू नो शेम समन बिकॉज आई हैव डन दैट इन पास्ट व्हेन आई वाज यू नो जस्ट स्टार्टेड वर्किंग इन दिस स्पेस आई थिंक इन 2015 माय मुझे याद है मेरी एक कलीग ने मेरे को झाड़ा था शी वाज 30 समथिंग देन एंड आई आई वाज मच यंगर टू हर तो उसने मेरे को झाड़ा था राजू से व्हाई डू यू नीड टू यू नो कॉल सो मेनी नेम्स इतने डिस्पोजेबल पैड को इतने सारे एडजेक्टिव क्यों लगाने तुमको वाई डोंट यू प्लेनली से दिस इज अ गुड ऑल्टरनेटिव ट्राई दिस जस्ट से इट ना इतना तुम उसका मतलब यू नो यू आर स्केर मॉन्गरिंग एंड डूइंग थिंग्स तो उसने मुझे बोला एंड दैट जस्ट चेंज इन मी एंड लाइक अरे हाँ थैंक यू फॉर डूइंग इट सो तब एकदम मैं एकदम मुझे गुस्सा आया था एक पल के लिए क्योंकि मुझे ऐसा लगा था कि क्या ये मैं इसको इतना अच्छे से बता रही हूँ और ये मुझे क्रिटिसाइज कर रही है बट देन आफ्टर समाइम इन रिफ्लेक्टेड आई रियलाइज वॉट आई वॉज डूइंग यू डोंट नीड टू शेम अ यूजर और एनी वन for what they are doing or what they are using like and firstly it's not just about product matlab uske mindset se na na bahar nikalne ki zarurat hai there is something called practices so we need to focus more on practices matlab aap cloth bhi use kar rahe ho and if you are not using it well there is a issue if you are using a disposable product if you are not disposing it well or you, you are using it for 24 hours like recently i was into a debate with someone सेड कि हमारा पैड आप 12 से 16 घंटे यूज कर सकते हैं एंड शी वाज अ डॉक्टर शी वाज अ प्रमोटिंग अ प्रोडक्ट एंड आई टोल्ड हर कि बॉस यू आर अ डॉक्टर एंड जस्ट इन द सेशन यू सेड कि हर 6 घंटे में पैड बदलना है देन तो मैंने बोला हाउ डज दिस बोथ गो टुगेदर सो यू नो ऑल दिस वी नीड टू थिंक ऑफ मतलब इसलिए मैंने बहुत सालों से ये स्टैंड लिया है कि कोई कोई भी प्रोडक्ट यूज करे यूज इट इन अ हेल्दी वे डिस्पोज इट इन अ हेल्दी वे That is most important thing. मतलब आप cloth use करो, cloth pad use करो, या और कुछ use करो. Doing it responsibly, making informed choice about it. कि मुझे पता है इसको छह घंटे में बदलना है या whatever घंटे में बदलना है. Knowing the pros and cons of it and then choosing it. So we as an educator, that onus is on us that we need to empower people to make them think like this. कि मतलब एक खुद चॉइस कर सको जस्ट सेंग दैट वन एस्पेक्ट 
कि तुम ये इस्तेमाल कर रहे हो ये ये तो तुम तुमको तो ये करना ही नहीं चाहिए प्रोडक्ट में भी रॉन्ग और राइट आई मीन गुड और बैड बट शेविंग द यूजर वो मे और मे नॉट बी अवेयर और मे मे और मे नॉट बी इन अ कंडीशन टू शिफ्ट there could be a hundred other right, reasons right so yes so yes yes that aspect is something that there like if i honestly if you ask me i mean it, it could have been anyway very evident also but i am someone who would not be happy with a disposable pad but however i understand that i can't shame someone for using a disposable pad कि भाई तुमको तो एनवायरमेंट की पड़ी ही नहीं है भाई तुमको तो क्या तुमको अपने बॉडी की नहीं पड़ी है उसमें कैंसर कॉजिंग चीज है so i can say i can say that disposables have carcinogens or they they are but i can't say that you don't care uh, you know that right aspect. right yeah, yeah language as sanjina said language uh-huh. matters a lot true kaise true. bol rahe ho wahi cheez aap usko kaise bol rahe ho if you say it ki you know i care for you and i think you should think of this product maybe they will like the proposal so uh, you know putting it that way instead of saying ki ye kya kar rahi ho and i have seen friends doing it for each other like i uh, have seen this conversation happening so i know someone these two friends one was a cup user and another one was not ready to try cup i am like fine tumko kya use karna hai tum batao we will be here to support so uh, we, some of us offered help but this friend was very adamant on you know you think cup bol ki वो इतनी बिजी है कि उसके पास टाइम ही नहीं बाकी कुछ करने के लिए तब तो वो कब यू चेंज करेगी ना मतलब कुछ भी यूज करेगी तो दूर तो जाना ही पड़ेगा ना तो शी वॉज ऑल बींग वेरी एडमेंट एंड शी इज लाइक वेरी खुशी एंड एंड दिस पियर लाइक एज मच मैंने स्टडी किया था कुछ साल पहले उसमें लिखा था कि पियर के सपोर्ट से एंड पियर वाला जो पार्ट है दैट इज वेरी एविडेंट बट एंड स्केयर इफ इट पियर थिंग इज यू नो वर्किंग इन सच वे सो आई डोंट वांट दैट टू हैपन इट कुड बी अ लिटिल बिट टू इंट्रोड्यू इंट्रूडिंग इनटू समवनस स्पेस या या एंड चूजिंग फॉर देम इवन दे आर नॉट रेडी करेक्ट करेक्ट या अम आल्सो अ yeah so anything anything else that you think should also be considered while you know going ahead with the project so one aspect uh, which sandeena mentioned twice was about the cultural um, you know aspects around whatever the community is wherever the community is so say for example i have known of uh, you know some people in rural karnataka uh, to be using a uh, layer they they uh, start in layers uh, and not using any other pre period product so may, may, uh, you know manage their period flow and that i found was so amazing right i mean you're not using anything additional it's such a badhiya innovative keh lo jugadu keh lo jo bhi rasta but it's such an amazing way of utilizing what you have uh, and also ensuring comfort to yourself because you you tuck it in a way that could be really comforting so if we go there and shed our inhibitions ki bhai ye tum jo kar rahe ho to sahi nahi hai maza nahi hai isme tum ye le lo hamara product to that could be wrong but i think those kind of cultural or also the cultural aspects of bleeding into the earth there are uh, i don't know if they still do it but It's very few people do it i i know of someone who used to do some years ago so so they used to so what they used to do so this one woman she she was already menopausal then when i met her so she is like ki hame gadda khodte the and we used to actually sit uh, on that gadda a very small gadda aisa bahut bada gadda nahi um, just like you know aisa bas itna sa type ka and but us pe baitho time ke liye and then uh, like especially on when you feel that you know we gush and all that etc so just sit for that time and then you use cloth or you use uh, just your camera or what what were you were uh, in chatisgarh they wear lungi uh, even the women wear lungi uh, so so usne bhi lungi lapet leti thi she used to say ki hum multiple layers le lete so bhi dag lagte to bhi wo lungi mein lagte pata nahi chalta dark lungi so um, so this was like really old Uh, woman, I have met who did that, 
एंड सो उसलिए वो क्या है उसलिए काफी तो प्रैक्टिस है यू विल सी की काय के गोठे में बैठने के लिए बोलते हैं वगैरह सो दैट वॉज एक्चुअली रिलेटेड टू दैट बट लेटर इट टुक वेरी अग्री टर्न लाइक पीपल नॉट अंडरस्टैंडिंग एग्जैक्टली की क्या है क्या करने कहते थे Uh, एक और एक था कि गाय के गोठे में या फिर एक अलग सी जगह में यू नो यू ब्लीड तो uh, तो कुछ कुछ के कुछ कुछ के ओरिजिन वहां से मतलब आए हैं बट लेटर इट टुक अगली टर्न लाइक सो लाइक इवन माय नानी हु यूज टू से कि उनके घर पे ये साइड में बिठाना वाज वेरी कॉमन सो शी सेड कि साइड में बिठाना तुम्हारे घर में इट वॉज नॉट लुक डाउन अपॉन एक्चुअली सो माई नानी इज एटी समथिंग नाउ she said ki uh, it was not something that was you know no, wrong or not looked down upon because char din rest ke hai and when my nani was a teenager so uh, ek book my nani really liked uh, reading books so ek book aur uh, aur ek doll so wo leke aap kone mein baitho so i was like i was happy i was happy doing that so yeah. you know it's very perspective thing and i also know a lot of women who are in the 60s now who miss having periods because char din jo side mein bithate the that was compulsory rest from you know whatever work they did i uh, you will see that you know lot of housewives will complain this especially because they said ki because housewives means unpaid work basically there is no reward in that तो उनको वो चार दिन जब छुट्टी मिलती थी दैट वाज देयर यू नो काइंड ऑफ रिवॉर्ड और यू नो टाइम वेयर दे गेट सम पैम्परिंग और सम अटेंशन आई विल से नॉट पैम्परिंग एग्जैक्टली सम अटेंशन तो दे रियली मिस डूइंग दैट आफ्टर मेनोपॉज सो सो देयर आर पर्सपेक्टिव्स एंड वी नीड टू रिस्पेक्ट दोस पर्सपेक्टिव्स बिफोर सेइंग कि अरे ये क्या मतलब अब तो खुश हो जाओ पीरियड्स नहीं है वगैरह सो बट आई हैव सीन वुमेन गेटिंग सैड सो I think it's very personal and it's very cultural and वो सब बात है मतलब you can't मतलब अपने experiences लेके उधर नहीं जा सकते अपने experiences को share कर सकते हो but उस चश्मे से देखना छोड़ना पड़ेगा हमको अगर सच में community से connect करना है तो yeah that's also very important not looking through the lens of modernization also and, and one more thing one more thing yes capitalization and one more thing that i want to add is uh, assigning a product to particular community or matlab ye log ye product use karte hai ya in logo ne ye product use karna chahiye so you know this is totally wrong matlab jaise bolte ki cups is for elites or disposable product is for slum dwellers because they don't use hygienic practices or they don't use hygienic products so you know ye assigning hum kon hai matlab kon hai ye assign karne wale we should not do that i know some slum dwellers who use cup in mumbai she brought it from me she asked me to order so you know people make the choices you never know so you shouldn't assign such things um, ki inko ye chahiye ye chahiye jo ye word hai na that is wrong so mm-hmm. we need to work on that shift right so basically what can be definitely done is giving an idea about what all are the options that yes yes what are the practices both or products as well as practices which um, are healthy for them i'm not trying to say that matlab even if you are using a cloth wonderful just ensure that you are drying it out well you know in sun yes yes or do not yes. Um, put it under your towel or do not put it at some khopchas where you know you don't have uh, even air for that matter forget sunlight so uh, so you know things like that or ensure that if you are using some old clothes you you say a blouse or something you remove metal pieces from them say hook hai to nikal do bhai that's not healthy so maybe a lot of practices uh, around this is something that can definitely be spoken about or and also that there are these 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 products uh, and which you can choose for yourself i think that would um, that can be a very important part of the need ass- need assessment uh, you know an educational a session before you go for anything else i think that can be a good need assessment yes yes so for me i will say uh, i learned this from ecofem and some more organizations i will say i owe this uh, approach to them actually 
it's not something that came naturally to me i learned this from veterans in the field that uh, this pouch i carry this pouch i have it's a huge pouch actually and it has uterus model it also has disposable pad it also has a cloth pad it also has cups it also has period panties and a tampon so i need to keep this because i am an educator and i need to show this to people तो वो फील लेंगे वो देखेंगे फिर उसके बाद वो डिसाइड करेंगे कि उनको क्या अच्छा लगता है सो वी नीड टू मतलब वो हमको मतलब वो एक अप्रोच अगर हम रखते हैं तो कैसा है ना कि लोगों को खुद पता चलेगा कि उनके लिए क्या सही है क्या गलत है और आई ऑल्सो फील जस्ट जस्ट एंडिंग इट हियर लाइक फ्रॉम माई साइड कि जब हम सेशन के लिए जाते हैं तो लाइक आई कॉल देम सीड सेशन मतलब ये अगेन दिस टर्म इज बिन बोरोड फ्रॉम सम वन सीड सेशन मतलब यू सो अ सीड इन दैम वॉट यू वॉट एवर यू स्पोक टू दैम यू सो अ सीड एंड दे रिफ्लेक्ट ऑन इट एंड लाइक देम यू नो डिसाइड एंड देन इफ दे रियली लाइक इट दे विल कम बैक टू यू इफ दे डिट लाइक इट और मतलब उनको जो आप कर रहे हो आप डिसग्री कर रहे विल नॉट टेक इट वॉट एवर सो I think there was one thing that uh, I had spoken with Sanjina on call once, and she had said that वो लोग ये करते थे कि session होने के बाद they will say कि तुम pad use करोगे अगर तुम करोगे तो तुम use कर लो अगर नहीं करोगे तो you can keep it back. So I really like that approach कि you know you are asking it even though you have given them one product you do not have other options but at least you are bothering to check. whether they will use or not whether the resource will be used ya yeah, aise hi rehna hai right. so we right, have right. extensive uh, feedback system in place so hum mm-hmm. jabhi bhi jate hain hum apne community ke koi bhi contact number kuch to leke aate hain and we always tell them that we are only going to call you a month or two later to just find out how is your experience and despite of jin cases mein hum log actually kuch distribute kar rahe hain we have kind benevolent uh donors who have come on board and they, we have who have come on board to distribute sickups or uh, cloth pads and we already know i myself am a user of both the products i know how safe and nice and uh, convenient it is but it is also important that you know you allow them not allow but to give them the space to talk about their uh, expectations also so we always say right. ki hum dene aaye hain isliye aap le loge aisa nahi hona chahiye aap right. hamare paas hai aur agar aap nahi loge to bhi it's fine but take it only if you are confident that you are going to use it don't take it just because but raha hai to main leke aake you know i'll hold it at home don't do that and right. uh, try and we do call them even after they come on board and they take it we always call them back we always collect feedback uh what went right what did go well with you uh example ek community mein menstrual cup slum mein menstrual cup was quite successful but dusre community mein jahan pe main khud char baar ja chuki hu main dekhti hu ki yaar washroom itna uh, uh sad state mein hai to wahan pe i know they have asked for cups but नहीं मेरे में दम नहीं है कि यू नो कप्स में दू क्योंकि यार वो वॉशरूम ही क्लीन नहीं है एंड दैट्स व्हाई आई एम सेइंग कि सेफ मेंस्ट्रुएशन इज नॉट अबाउट प्रोडक्ट यहां पे नीड है उनका नीड भी है चाह भी है बट इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर नहीं है वहां पे मैं अगर दूंगी इट ओनली एक्ट एज अ बर्डन फॉर ऑल ऑफ अस हु आर इन्वॉल्वड इन दिस प्रोसेस सो इफ क्लॉथ पैड इज वर्किंग वेल फॉर देम then it's okay they don't but the aisa necessary nahi hai ki maine char product ke bare mein bataya to community ke logo ko char product apnane hi hai it's okay no we just need to chill a bit also yeah and also not put <laughs> them in classes ki cup is the best or cloth pad is the best or this right 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 i think yes um so i think i am done with all the points i had to follow Uh, is there anything else that you can think of, or maybe then we will sign off? Or even viewers can ask us if uh, you yes. have any questions. I'm sorry, I just realized I didn't welcome anyone. I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> so 
sorry people <laughs> yeah so if anyone has any question maybe feel free to say uh, in the meanwhile there was one point that came to my mind was about um, numbers uh jaise i just know of some ngos who my i personally know them for a lot of their other work and i really respect them they've been doing some amazing work on ground but um, this there was this one project about uh, distribution of sanitary napkins and they said we will distribute 1 million sanitary napkins so ek to mujhe aadha heart attack aa gaya ki shit ye kahan dispose honge but the whole obsession matlab agar aapne cloth pad distribute karne hai to you will not need that matlab itne saro ki zarurat hi nahi padegi for the same set of menstruators you know the same number of menstruators but because they also want to show matlab not about this particular ngo but any one for that matter because they want to show huge numbers that we distributed say a 10000 or a lakh or whatever number of products they would want to go for something which is use and throw over something hmm. reusable instead of counting that how many lives are they touching upon whichever is the bigger number that they that could be usually picked up because that works well for csr activities to show up in the reports and also for funding for a lot of ngos ki bhai humne itna kiya hai to maybe you can give funds and then we will touch for the more so uh, numbers also play a role in in this yes yes yeah having um... having my own organization i understand why why is it important and how it pans out uh me do you don't even look at you know uh, institutional funding i'm talking about individual friends and families jab hum log crowd funding karte the and rajshi has seen uh, the crowd funding that we did during our lockdown times uh all the donations that have come to that platform has been from friends and family and the idea is ki main itne se paise mein itna zyada kaise kar sakti in fact hmm you know? so that's how the donors mentality also work donors again going to the, back to the previous point do not understand their logistical costs also there's resource cost also there is travel and all of that is involved ye samajhte nahi hai aur matlab sometimes i don't know like mujhe pata hai sometimes we are also compelled to talk about numbers and but then those are like opening conversations but then at the end of it the conversation takes a different you know change that's how i put and also i've learned another way through the work that i'm doing that you can put numbers in a different way also so the other day i was writing a small report where we did a distribution for about i think 100 women 100 sex workers with an organization student led organization here in calcutta called stronger kolkata initiative uh, and i was just calculating uh, the numbers ulta karke ki for 400 pads that we distributed uh, we have managed to save 54000 pads from going to the landfill we have saved uh, around 3 lakh 60000 rupees uh, from being spent so yahan pe bhi main bahut bade bade numbers use kar rahi hu but it's just how i'm projecting the numbers uh, so, so that's, that's another way of looking at it also looking at it absolutely that's that's actually a very good way of looking at it right 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 wonderful yeah so i think and there is just uh, one point yeah. that i would like to add if we have time yeah go ahead so um, so all the possible donors who are looking here who are viewing this video uh, i would like to share ki agar aap ye 1 million ya aise kuch bhi matlab jo bhi aap targets apne apne le rahe ho uh, one time activity jitna acha dikhta hai photos mein newspapers mein acha dikhta hai i know मेरा भी कभी छपके आया तो मुझे भी तब अच्छा लगा था एंड फ्रैंकली स्पीकिंग मेरा फोटो आया था और मेरा नाम ही नहीं आया था इट इज अनदर स्टोरी बट देन मतलब ऐसा सब होता है एंड वी रियली लाइक यू नो समथिंग लाइक दैट हैपेंस 
but i would like to you know ask you or maybe give this points to people who want to donate in future ki abhi aap de rahe ho unko like i have seen this happening because i work with schools so tab maine dekha hai ki school mein na ikattha ek bar de dete hain पर तब वो सिर्फ वन टाइम के लिए लेकर आते हैं एंड इफ दो गर्ल्स लाइक इट दैट कम्युनिटी लाइक्स द प्रोडक्ट देर इज नो वे टू गो बैक एंड यू नो गेट दैट प्रोडक्ट सो आई हैव नोन सम ऑर्गेनाइजेशंस जिन्होंने चूज किया कि हम डिस्पोजेबल पैड्स देंगे दे हैव मतलब वो बोले कि हम एजुकेशन देंगे एंड वी विल डिस्पोजेबल पैड्स हमने uh, और उन्होंने नंबर्स को ना मतलब दे हैव गिवन रियली लेस इम्पोर्टेंस सो उन्होंने बोला कि हम ये दस स्कूल हमने डिसाइड किए दस स्कूल एंड आई थिंक दे आर ऑल्सो वर्किंग विद प्रिजन दे आर ऑल्सो वर्किंग देर तो उन्होंने डिसाइड कर लिया कि हम ये जो दस बारह है वॉट एवर उनके साथ ही काम करेंगे एंड वी विल एंश्योर दैट दे गेट एक्सेस टू एस आर एच आर सर्विसेस एंड दे विल ऑल्सो गेट टाइमली डिस्पोजेबल प्रोडक्ट दैट्स ओके दैट दे चोज डिस्पोजेबल प्रोडक्ट बट टाइमली दैट इज आई रियली लाइक दैट अप्रोच की मतलब उन्होंने समझ लिया है कि उस कम्युनिटी को प्रोडक्ट अच्छा लगेगा तो वापस जरूरत पड़ेगी तो वो बार बार उनको जाके देते भी है एंड दैट इज समथिंग दैट इज वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग यू नो अपार्ट फ्रॉम व्हाट प्रोडक्ट दे गिव मतलब शायद हम कुछ अग्री ना भी करें उससे बट दैट इज समथिंग दैट दैट अप्रोच इज वेरी नाइस दैट यू नो यू मतलब कब तक प्रोवाइड करने वाले ये क्वेश्चन आप खुद को पूछो अब इन्होंने डिसाइड कर लिया कि इस कम्युनिटी को जरूरत है और उस कम्युनिटी ने भी बताया है कि यू नो देर इज नो अदर सोर्स ऑफ गेटिंग द प्रोडक्ट सो वी वुड depend on you that is fine okay. but that is well communicated so we need to ask this ki kab tak karoge aur ek bar ja ke wo purega kya like i have seen even in this pandemic situation log bas ek packet dete the i think sanjana aur meri bhi ye baat hui thi ki ek packet mein bas sath pad aate wo kaise kisi ko matlab uh, you know how is it going to suffice to mm-hmm. aise hum sawal agar khud ko puchhenge matlab i really ask sometimes i sit with donors and i ask them ki ये प्रोडक्ट आप खुद यूज करोगे क्या और इतना ही यूज करोगे क्या यू नो थिंक ऑफ इट इफ योर डॉटर विल यूज इट इफ यू यूर सेल्फ विल यूज इट तो अगर उसका जवाब ना आ रहा है तो इसका मतलब यू नीड टू चेंज योर स्ट्रेटेजी और यू नीड टू चेंज द प्रोडक्ट वॉट एवर इट इज सो सो आई थिंक दिज आर दॉइंटर्स फ्रॉम माई साइड so it was amazing talking to you both uh, i'm glad we are talking about this discussion that we've had otherwise on phone calls here and there and <laughs> right <laughs> so um, it's amazing thank you so much uh, for the time and we didn't realize but it's already 1 hour and 20 minutes that we've been speaking so awesome um thank you so much for joining see you soon thank you bye bye Bye. It was nice Bye. speaking to you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. And thank you for joining, people. Bye.